Leslie, I can't thank you enough for helping put this together. For all of my new friends at AMB Gaming, all of my dear friends at Codemasters, everyone who's been working on Dirt 5 tirelessly, thank you so much for outfitting me in the coolest, reddest and raddest way for me to come back to PC Gaming. The whole setup for this was, um, I, I open up this box and then I get this lovely envelope. Uh, and in the envelope was an amazing letter that says, Hi Troy, I hope you love and enjoy your new PC. Should you have any questions or issues, technical or otherwise, feel free to contact me at, and it's from Leslie Peritano. So, I figured, as she has her own trading cards. I mean, all right, Leslie, you are with us now. And I figured I could either guess and I could read off this amazing, I mean, obviously when you open this box, the first thing that you're greeted with is the instruction manual. Um, right. Which, you know, as, as a good American male, I instantly throw that away. Uh, because who needs instructions? I'm not gonna read instructions, no. But I figured who better to talk about all of the amazingness and the specs and the text of all of this um, than you yourself. So will you do me a favor? Tell me about my brand new amazing awesome computer! <laughs> <laughs> It is awesome. So we, we work with a company called, um, it's EK as in, they, they make water blocks also. You can see the water blocks there behind me. Whoa. My theme is purple, yours is red. <laughs> Ooh. Here, I'll go back to, to dirt, dirt five because that's also part of the theme of your, of your computer, so. Well, absolutely, we, we should absolutely mention the fact that Codemasters, uh, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm in the new Dirt 5 uh, that's coming out this fall, and they we were just kind of talking, I was like, well, what's the best way to play this game? And they were like, well, PC. And I was like, oh, okay. Because I've been a console boy. I grew up as a PC gamer my entire life. And then once consoles came out, I was like, I guess this is what you could do. I I was one of those beggars can't be choosers kind of gamers because I grew up, I grew up dirt poor. <laughs> Um, and I had to go to my friend's house to play whatever console they had. So some people had the Nintendo, some people had Commodore 64, some people had Atari, and then eventually people had like Xbox and so on. So I was the guy that was just constantly going around to different houses and like whatever they were playing, I was getting the scraps from their tables. So, uh, but growing up as a PC gamer, because my dad was into computers when I was younger, this is like bringing me back to my roots. But I have a feeling that things have changed a little bit, including the fact that there's a lot of cabling. Yeah. <laughs> ah, ah. I'm feeling I should probably get this one out. Um, so how do the water blocks and the colors kind of come into play? Yeah, EK, who's, who for years has specialized in liquid pooling. And so that's who I worked with to get your, your PC for you because they specialize in liquid pooling. Now what liquid cooling is, is it's an option for keeping your components like your CPU and graphics card cool. That, that looks like a spare tube. I, I just didn't know if it's like, and you can also get a, you know, you can uh, cath yourself. If you, you can to. snorkel so is, afterwards or something. <laughs> snorkeling is better. Snorkeling is way better. We'll go with snorkeling. Liquid cooling is how we're going to keep, you said not only the the CPU, but also the GPU, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I cool. had them I had them liquid cool both, both of your components, both the CPU and the GPU. You know, it will make a few things complex. Like if you ever wanted to upgrade your CPU and your and or your graphics card. Why would I want to? This thing is amazing already, right? Yeah, this yeah. This gonna keep me... I tell you what that is the most challenging thing is the box. Putting it boxes. is heavy because it has water in it. Oh now wait a minute. I did it. <sighs> what about... Here. Yeah, it's, yeah. So that's gonna keep your CPU weird. and graphics card cool. Um, I think uh, the aesthetics are great on it. it. You know, your your red theme color is gonna come out really nice. Your your water is gonna be red as well as the RGB in there. They got everything ready for you. Ah, wait a minute, wait a minute. Look at that. Ah, there we go. That feels like a yes. Yeah. All now, right. here's here's what people now we can see the logo on the front too. Look at this, yeah. So form fitted. There you go. Yeah. 
<laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. So I want to make sure that people are seeing this right there. Boom. That is the Dirt 5 logo. Yep. So is this is this something that there was um, they're doing just like a Dirt 5 edition or this week we did just for you. Just for you. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. Wait, a, are, are they going to be some like there's there nobody at like Codemasters even has this PC? So at the moment they don't, but they have asked for one. I bet they have. <laughs> they, so they they may be getting one, but yeah. Once you see, you're like, I want you're one. The only person with it. Oh, as much as I kind of I love those guys, I kind of want to be the only one that gets this. All right, I'm gonna put this. <laughs> did you did okay. you also get the monitor? I did. I'm looking at you right now on it. My poor lonely <laughs> monitor. That was the other thing. I was like, okay, I got this great PC. What am I gonna be watching on? It's like, we've got you. So AMD Gaming also sent me my first 35 inch ultra wide view Sonic. I feel like I, that, that scene from Wizard of Oz where she walks out of the house and everything is, I was like, is this what the world is really supposed to look like? Um, so incredible 35 inch uh, curved monitor that, you know, the reason why we chose that for you was because that's gonna be pretty awesome playing Dirt 5. <laughs> <laughs> well, and especially in a racing game, I mean, I think about it, there's, there's been, been racing games that I've played before to where you're like, my periphery extends to here, right? But a lot of time gaming is right here. So I can only imagine, especially when seconds count and being able yeah. to see who's on my left and who's on my right, just trying to sneak past me. Yeah. Of course, that yep. I've, I've made. All right. Um, GPU, what are we looking so at? So the graphics card is the Radeon 5700 XT. So that, yep, the 5700 XT. Yeah, it's a really beautiful graphics card. You know, it's uh, got eight gigabytes of video memory on it, eight, eight gigabytes of RAM on there. Dirt 5 runs fantastic on it. So because Dirt 5 is also being built, you know, with AMD graphics cards, you know, it's gonna be optimized for it and stuff like that. You're gonna really just have a smooth, smooth time. So we're gonna go a little ASMR mode. Um... <laughs> Look at that. Come on, guys. How many of you people right now are either freaked out or just like, that's the, that's better than ice cream? And then I've got a sticker. It was behind a sticker. Uh, they're like, let's see how long it takes them to figure this out. We'll hide it behind like, a sticker. <laughs> that's why they said, read the instructions. And I'm like, no, I don't want to read the instructions. Holy now wow, that is beautiful. So you, you've got in there, you've got a, a an Asus X570 motherboard, which means you've got PCI Express 4.0, really nice RGB motherboard, really sweet lighting, and you know integrated in there as well. Dude, this is the cool, like my old PC was nothing like this. Yeah. I have 100% <laughs> leveled up. I I can't wait to give this thing a test drive. Let me tell you more about the specs. Give me the full blown deals. That X570 motherboard also has the Ryzen 7 3800X. It's a very sweet processor, has eight cores, 16 threads, so that allows the multi-threading to do, you know, you can stream while you're playing a game, while you're capturing a video, you know, while you're doing email, whatever. It has 32 gigabytes of level three cache, has 32 gigabytes of DDR4 memory at 3200 megahertz processing speed. Um, RGB by G-Skill, it's the Trident Z memory. It has a terabyte M.2 NVMe drive. It's a Samsung 970 Evo. So what? There's actually a storage drive as well. So you have your, your terabyte hard drive that's on the motherboard. That's gonna be your super fast boot. Um, you know, you can put your Steam on there and all of that, but you have a storage drive where you can have your games download to or other files. It's a four terabyte storage drive. Um, that's a, a SATA drive, so so it is cabled and plugged into the back of the the motherboard on the other side of the the motherboard wall there. I'll see you guys on the track. Thank you so very much for checking this out. You can always check out more stuff, uh, amazing tech powered by AMD at AMD Gaming. 
Uh, check out at Codemasters and check out the Dirt 5 game. Thank you so much. Yeah.